salutations everybody it's me Nancy Cole and I'm here today without the kids why because it's year of the ear it's my favorite swap um that's reoccurring <laughs> I have some swaps coming up that I'm really, really, really excited for, but this one has been, now this is in its second year. If you haven't heard of it, it's an ear swap where we are given a one word prompt and we are inspired by that prompt. We can take into consideration somebody's preferences, but we do not have to. It's a no preference, no pressure, just create, swap a pair of ears. And now like we're allowed to give two if we want to, which is super exciting. So if you're new here, welcome. And if you're returning, welcome back. You know what to do to let us know that you like us or you dislike us and how to stick around. It's so greatly appreciated. This is last month's, which was Flower and Garden. A little off the cusp, I will say, but I adore these, Meg, and I'm super, super excited to get my next ones. I will say this is created by Mary and Tony. Most of the months are given out, but you can contact her. If you yourself um, are a YouTube creator and like to make ears and want to get in on the fun, this is something that I love, whether I'm participating or not, to watch and witness the inspiration and how unique. Like, we can have 36 people in a swap, which is close to what we have in this month. And most people won't do anything similar. Like, it's so amazing. So I'm super excited. I can't wait for this month. So this month's theme is pink. Pink. <laughs> pink. And this is in celebration of a wonderful woman and her triumph over breast cancer. So this is the anniversary. So Mary, I'm so, so grateful that you are here and that you inspire so many to keep fighting and to go get checked and just, you, you wear pink with such pride. So I can't wait. I'm gonna open up my box and let's get into this. Um, Please, I will have everybody linked down below. Go watch what everyone created. See the pink masterpieces. Because even though the word is so simple, with just one color, I can guarantee it's going to be very, very unique in everyone's interpretation. Like, did they use characters that were pink? Did they use attractions? What did they use? I don't know. Okay, I finally got into it. Ready? Oh, so I have a bunch of uh, earth tone foozles, which are my favorite. I love like recycled paper. Salutations, Nicole. Oh my gosh, Melody, you're so cute. Um, I'm sorry. Salutations, Nicole has got a pink Tinkerbell. I hope you enjoy your ears I created for you. I was intimidating creating for you because you're so talented. I made something tailored to your preference, Melody. This is from Melody Phoenix. And, um, no one should ever be intimidated by me. I swear, I love creativity. I am not the best creator out there. I just have fun with, with what I'm doing. So, like, I just hope you have fun creating. And I'm sure I will love them. Okay, here we go. <laughs> I love it. I love it so much. Oh, my gosh. appreciative to the fact that you all are like greatly greatly accepting my heart <laughs> I'm gonna take these wonderful Jurassic Park ears off so that I can put these wonderful and amazing Mamasaurus <laughs> pink ears and she has been creating in um it's a uh, in a resin and she has this a beautiful pink glittered resin and she has the vinyl over it and we have a pterodactyl and it says mommy saurus and then right here is this nice firm foam bow which means it is like water can pelt on these and they are not flopping over there is nothing to them they're held on really well there's the headband she uses has hair um things to help keep them on because they don't feel incredibly heavy but they are a little heavier than like foam 
Um, but she adheres them on with fish line and then this decorative trim. These are so amazing. I love, I can't get, oh, I love them. Of course I do because they have a, and they're comfortable. These are so comfortable. Like really, really comfortable. I have an abnormally small head. So most of the time they hit far too low on me. Um, so they pinch a little more than they would normally. But, oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Um, <laughs> hi. I don't hide my love for the prehistoric and what came before. I think that we learned so much from what came before in the past and I have been enamored by dinos for for a very long time like since I went and seen Sue the Tyrannosaurus Rex at um the Chicago Museum <laughs> I've been like that is a just a gigantic creature that was wiped out by the power of weather and the earth and the atmosphere and stuff like that so enough about that these are amazing and I love them and I cannot wait to find the perfect shirt to go with I am not kidding when I say that my dino collection is my largest ear collection I own um and I'm not mad about it at all like I absolutely absolutely love them and I thank you so much please don't be why would you be intimidated these are amazing and you've honed in on your own creative way to make ears. I know she'll print out things and resin over them. This is what I, I love how everyone's mind works and how they're inspired by something that they love or something that the other person loves and that they just run with it. This is why it's one of my favorite swaps. This is why like I continue to do it. But I thank you so much for watching. Please make sure you go and check out everybody else's channel. See what was created. See what was gifted to them. See the creativity. Be inspired by the word pink. If you're a woman, make that appointment. It's really, really important. And, um, and I thank you so much, Melody, for these awesome ears. And I thank you, Mary and Tony, for creating such a platform for us to all share month after month. And I celebrate you. I am grateful to know that you both exist upon a plane that I exist on. So I hope that you are having a wonderful day, that the people that are within your bubble celebrate you for every little triumph, every part of your story, and that you have an amazing day and a great, big, beautiful tomorrow. Bye-bye.